it's a beautiful sunny day in fact summer is here so what is summer if you don't make a beautiful barbecue treat keep watching Greetings to you all beautiful people. How is it going out there? To my returning subscribers, you guys are amazing. You keep me going. You encourage me and I appreciate you. If you're new here, please don't go away without hitting that subscribe button and turn on the notifications so that when I post any of my videos, you won't miss out. So today we are going outdoor. It's a beautiful sunny day. Summer is here. So what is summer? If you don't make barbecue, be it beef, fish, chicken or whatsoever. So making this sharp broiled or charcoal grilled red snapper, you must not use red snapper. I just love red snapper because it's my favorite fish. You can use the same ingredients for any other fish. So let's get started. We have some cumin powder and onion powder. ginger and garlic paste chili flakes i just want it spicy some paprika curry powder if you've never tried curry powder on grilled fish trust me you have to definitely try it black pepper maggi and seasoned salt while in this other bowl we have blended parsley the description box has a detailed measurement and everything we have this fleshy gutted skilled and perfectly cleaned red snapper and of course the olive oil so mix all the ingredients together in a separate bowl and add some oil in this recipe since we are going to be sharp broiling i always use a little bit of water in my marinade because of the heat so you can add a little bit of water inside this marinade. That one is optional, but I just like putting a little bit of water in all my ingredients. Prep and marinate the fish appropriately.
Cover and let it rest in the refrigerator for one hour. For this remaining marinade, just put a little bit of water inside and microwave for like 2 to 3 minutes so you don't apply raw marinade while grilling the fish. So the fish is now from the refrigerator. So right here I'm just applying some oil spray in it. Doing chabrelling, I just put oil spray but this is optional. If you don't want extra oil on the fish, you can skip this part. Transfer the fish to a grilling basket. If you don't have a grilling basket, you can grill direct on the barbecue grill. Right now we have the fish on the grill. The heat here is just on medium because I don't want the fish to get burnt in the outside while it's raw in the inside. So you don't need too much heat while grilling the fish. So right now the other side is cooked. I'm just going to flip sides, see how it looks. Very nicely brown color while you're grilling. Keep applying the marinade. So guys, I have amazing red snapper recipes, oven grilled the fillet oven baked a lot of fish recipes i'm going to drop the links in the description box so you can check them out keep applying the marinade from time to time just to make the fish moist and give it that extra flavor So the other side has been fully cooked let's see how it looks look at that look at that that crunchiness that's why i always apply oil on the fish the fish has been fully cooked and it's ready to devour Let's see how it looks in the inside. See, it's very crunchy in the outside and moist in the inside. I just can't resist. I just have to give it a taste. Mm-hmm. There you go. So guys, you can definitely try this recipe, like I said before, with any other fish. It mustn't be red snapper. I just so, 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 so love red snapper. You can try with any other fish. I just can't resist eating the fish. I was just supposed to give you just a single taste or a single bite. but <laughs> So this is the best part of the fish, like close to the head. You have that thick, fleshy part on it. In fact, guys, let me just leave you. Let me just leave you here. Thank you so much for watching and I appreciate you for stopping by as usual. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like and share. Thank you and trust my recipes. Bye-bye.